Hello everyone, I am Veos and welcome back to another video. This time I want to do something really simple. I don't have a whole lot of time, but I wanted to see if I could make the smallest SSRT with the tiniest payload that I can. I'm sure people have already done this before, but I've never done it. So let me go ahead and give it a shot. Tiniest payload. So we're going to need something really lightweight super lightweight something reusable okay now we're gonna make our itty bitty little satellite teeny tiny and what's a satellite without gadgets Okay, that's a cute little satellite. I like that. It's it's adorable. <laughs> it's cute and adorable. It just doesn't have any reaction stuff whatsoever. So it'd be t uh, hmm. That's that's a good uh, that's a good uh hmm. Does it? I don't think that. Oh, hold on. No. 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 No reaction wheel. Well, shit. This one has a reaction wheel though. It's twice the weight. However, hmm. Interestingly enough. Mixing this with this, the OK222, the OKTO2, would result in a weight of 0 0.09, which is actually lighter than this one. There really is no way to put this thing in a fairing, is there? Hmm, I have an idea. Let me try something else. Oh, wait, hmm, okay, hold on. Okay, what should we choose here? Something interesting. Oh, ho, ho, ho. okay, hold on. Uh, how about this? Ew. Oh, wait, that kind of looks, nah. Hmm, 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 nah. Ah, that looks neat. That looks really cool, actually. <laughs> But, nah, that's that's more something like for, well, like a mining colony, which, by the way, I haven't forgotten about. Probably work on that when I get the time. <laughs> Desert military. It's a military satellite. That, that actually looks pretty cool. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, so for right now, that looks pretty decent. For right now. Now, oh, how do I want to do this? It all needs to be as yellow and rusty, and you have Anakin Skywalker's pod racer engine. I love what they did to the flags. There's so much you can do with them now. So pretty. It's so beautiful. I almost want to see if I can't make the whole thing. Yeah, but I know flags are going to create drag, right? Drag is going to be a huge issue with that, isn't it? Okay, so, so far we're not even a ton yet. We're with 0 0.3 tons. Uh, and this is pretty much the payload and everything, the core and whatnot, power. This is it. This is what the rocket has to get up there and come back down. Okay, let's, let's keep going. You know, I would put that nose cone parachute right here, that tiny one, but it's been, I have done tests and that thing creates a tremendous amount of drag, so I'm not gonna. That's a no. Okay, so I'm gonna pick the twitch. It's a uh, 0.08 tons. It has uh, like one less thrust than the spark does, but the spark is 0.13 tons or 13. So for two twitches, <laughs> two twitches, I can get twice the uh, thrust and only have to pay 0.16 tons or 16. So I think for a little bit of, a little bit more mass, I can get more thrust. It's not going to make too much of a difference. Plus, I think it will help a little bit with directional thrust or the, you know, having two gimbals on one side or two gimbals. My goodness, two gimbals. Yes, you know what I mean. Left, right, roll, that kind of thing. Even though we do have an, a reaction wheel, it's always nice to have more control. I can change the color too. <laughs> That's cool. Looking good so far. Might put a little bit more fuel on here. It's getting a little long for my tastes. 
All right, we'll test this out. And um, if we have more fuel than what we possibly need, we'll chop it down a little bit. Looks like some sort of missile now. Uh, a hellfire. You know what would be really cool now, now that I think of it? If it landed like SpaceX. So I'm going to put the parachute up here a little bit. And then I'm going to actually put kind of like little landing legs on this thing. Hmm. Hold up now. Our Delta V dropped. Oh, sh... Wow. These parachutes are heavy. Maybe I should go parachute less. Wow, putting on the wings, I've lost 200 Delta V. Hmm. Maybe we should go wingless, too. Damn it, I kind of like my missile. I kind of liked the missile thing going on. Um, crap. And that just tears it down. That's almost 10, that's almost, that's almost a thousand Delta V gone with those three things in there. Mother sucker. <laughs> oh, come on, man. That was so nice. It was doing so well. Okay, um, yet. Are those really that heavy? 0.14. How about the gears? 0 0.015. Ooh, these are lighter. Yeah, but they still lose 2000 Delta V. And I'm sure the physics on these things are gonna create immense drag. All right, we'll try this. Yep, oh dear. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh boy. How's the drag looking? I'm sure those flags are gonna create plenty of drag. Yeah, it's falling over pretty quick. Let's try that again. Hold on a second. I just noticed something. I have enough lift to get off the ground easily, but it's like these landing gears uh, it's almost like they're stuck to the ground. That's so weird. It's almost like they're sucking to the ground, you know, before... Alright, see, when I when I do this, it, it om it's almost like they get un... It's like they're suction cups, almost. Here we go. Ready? Go. And then... Uh, then it... Le okay, so that's... Let me try that again, only without the landing gears, or the landing gears disengaged. See if it stays there for a few seconds before it takes off again. And here we go. No, sure doesn't. Takes off immediately. Well, well, well. Ain't that a bit shit. Gotta look out for the suction cup landing gears as well. First the suction cup kerbals, then the suction cup landing gears. Mm-hmm. Okay, this is proving harder than I thought. Starting to look a little bit like the Delta Clipper. All right, here we go. Whoa. Hmm, okay. Oh wait, I think I see what's going on. Let's try that. Pretty close. Pretty close. Pretty close. Hmm. Let me test out the cargo stuff first. Uh-huh. Interesting. I know what's going to happen if I switch this out with a little parachute nose cone thing. It's going to kill my Delta V. Okay, we're in space and we have enough Delta V, I think, to land this sucker. All right, let's see if we can land this baby. All right, moment of truth. <laughs> ah, well, 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 isn't that nice? Alrighty then, well, 
everyone thank you so much for watching love you all take care and i'll see you in the morning with another video wow i actually like this i mean i hate the fact that i had to really pack it on there but it's reusable and it's got neat little doors i mean who wouldn't love that right all right see you all later bye 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 bye